Greetings, raiders and antagonists, and welcome to a new installment of Inside Space Lords. Let's talk about the first big update in Space Lords roadmap. Space guilds that bring great innovations that will change the way we play the game. As you might have guessed already, the most important new feature are the guilds. Upon founding a guild, we will choose a name for it and design an emblem for the guild's pennant using the in-game editor to make it unique and different from other players' guilds. So how do the guilds work? Guilds can be public and thus joinable by all players or private and only accessible by invitation or by sending a request to the owner. Once the guild has been founded, its members will be able to communicate and coordinate via chat to master their missions and maximize the rewards. The guilds can be cross-platform, allowing players from PlayStation 4 and Steam or Xbox One, Windows 10 and Steam to squat up together. But there are many other features that will arrive along with the guilds. Cortez's family to the rescue. When players disconnect from the game, one of Cortez's brothers will take their place until they reconnect. No more fighting with an understrength team. A proximity radar to avoid being caught unaware by your enemies. A preview of the rewards you will receive in the next five levels so you can plan your progress in the game. A revision of some classic missions like Hanging by a Thread and Short Fuse to make them more exciting. Some rare weapons have been updated with alternate fire modes or functionalities, more than 200 new cards and an integrated troubleshooting system for technical support. As you can see, Space Lords is getting ready for the arrival of more exciting content, including new weapons, skins and characters that will be released over the next few months. We hope you enjoy all these changes and see you on the Broken Planet.